one's for you. I said this one's for you. I said this one's for you. I said this one's for you. Uh, let me start at the beginning Way before the ratchetness Before they raped our women uh, Way black Black in the time A woman can't come from a man So she birthed mankind Through that holy yoni In between her legs divine You can't see it from this angle With the Eurocentric mind You've been trained well So your future is behind Take a look around, girl, the truth ain't hard to find See that white standard of beauty got you bleaching your mind For 400 years they said you was ugly but you're fine Shit, more than fine, got a beauty they can't match even Brains too strong and wise like Queen Sheba Most can't deal with your strength, that's why they still beat ya Took you out the holy trinity but still need ya Back to black consciousness is where I'm trying to see ya I'm a star, you're a set, on the throne is where I keep ya Black woman Think your position is minuscule Cook, clean, serve All you was put here to do Not realizing these qualities Were put into you Cause your leadership skills are natural Don't believe me, Queen and Zynga Led the war against them crackers, fool My people sleep, so I teach That's what a master do Grew up with visions of chauvinistic theatricals Now it's my mission to grab the culture And get back to you So we can show the seeds What it is they have to do Break the chains, run away, slave They coming after you Keep the men and women at odds And take the child too Make sure she have more than one baby Daddy, your daddy do Four hundred years later, no savior, they really lynched you So take a listen, black woman, let me heal you Any man that breaks you down, really fears you My elder Shabaka say what the women do, the men do So when you start the revolution, we right here with you Black woman ain't shit. I say this queen is everything, even the ratchets. You just forgot who you are. I'ma help you remember. You're the mother of civilization. From the light skin you to those darker than blue. Black woman, I never turn my back on you. You're beautiful without that perm. You're a queen without that weave. Love yourself, cause sister, I love you. Respect yourself, cause sister, I respect you. Apologies to those I disrespected before my mind was free. Let's take it back to go forward like Sankofa. Ride with she me. She was here when we was kings, chilling on the throne. Proper placement, utmost respect. Respected her needs, never neglected Embracing her higher consciousness The true essence, the procreator From her I got my best blessing My life she manifested I'm forever indebted to her collection Can't objectify her She's more than breast and flesh skin Think not, then you need correction Of your perception I'm talking about the first wonder of the world's possessions Here for more than cooking and cleaning Without her man wouldn't truly experience being Don't doubt her God
goddess ability of honing fertility just lever and preserve her identity the black woman when i see her something gets into me beautiful inspiration like a pyramid amazing brings out the best of me on occasion they made her forget who she was that's why i made this next time you're riding with your daughter brother play this At you at 60 frames per second, 720p. Thinking about kicking it up to 1080. <laughs> We're gonna let Brother Eddie Bear go on and, and, and greet the sun for us. Lord have mercy.
for the rest of my life. And you will follow me for the rest of my life. Cause I walk with good. Cause I walk with good. And I talk with good. And I talk, and I talk with, with good. good. And I am good. And, and I, I am, am good. good. And that feels real good. And, and that feels, feels real, real good. good. Good, better, best. Good, good better, best. best. Never let it rest. Never let it rest. rest. And say your good is your better. Yeah. And your good is your better. And your better is your best. And, and your better is your best. best. Black people. Black people. You were once great. You are you still great. great. You shall be great again. You, you shall be great as still. Lose not faith. Lose not faith. Lose not courage. Lose not courage. Go forward. Go forward. Uplift the race. Uplift the race. Harambe. 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 I don't got the fancy transition to it on here. Sitting up here, kids magic. And I still can't figure out what's going on with Shut my up. Here we go. Camera. Look like I'm in a bubble. Drink your water. Come on, come on. Drink your water, but first. Take your breath and drink some water. Take your breath. Take your breath and drink some water. Take your breath. Take Take your breath and drink some water. Take your breath. Drink, 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 drink. Or should I say, breathe, breathe, then drink. Take a breath. Take your breath. Now. Grab your glass for some water. Grab your glass. Lift your picture of that water Or bottle Get that picture of that water uh-huh. Simply pour, pour some, some water. water Drink, 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 drink Drink Or should water. I say Lift, pour, then drink Now move your body and drink some water Move your body Move your body and drink some water. Move your body. Move Move your body and drink some water. Bam. Just Just move move your your body. body. Drink, 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 drink. Drink your water. Or should I say, move, move, then drink. Move your body. Move your body. Now raise your glass and toast your ancestors. Raise your glass and toast your ancestors. Raise your glass and toast your ancestors, fam. Just raise your glass. Drink, 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 drink. Drink your water. Or should I say, raise, toast, then drink. Take your breath and drink some water. Take your breath. Lift and pour yourself some water. Pour. Move your body, drink some water. Move it. Raise your glass and toast your ancestors. Breathe, lift, move, toast. But remember to stay healthy, remember the four pillars. Breathe, drink, eat, move. Drink half your weight in ounces. Eat a culturally appropriate diet. Behave. Take your breath. Come on, come on. Take, take your breath. breath. Come on. Lift and pour. You can do it. Move your body. Come on, come on. Toast your ancestors. Drink up. Come on, drink it, drink it, drink it. Come on, you can do it. Come on, drink it. Lift and drink it. Come on, drink that health in. Drink, 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 drink. Drink Drink your water. Take your breath. Lift and pour. Lift it. Move your body. Come on, come on. Toast your ancestors. Drink, 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 drink. Drink your water. Drink, 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 drink. 
Come on, come on, drink, drink your water. Take your breath. Lift it, pour. Come on, pour it. Move your body. Come on, move. Toast your ancestors. Drink, 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 drink. What? Drink your water. Drink. Drink your water. I'm just trying to see what's going on with the video. Um, all right. So I need to, I know what I need to do. I can bring the camera down just a little bit. Yeah. There we go. So I'm looking like I'm drowning up under the red, black, and the green, right? Um, also, I'm trying to see because my frames are dropping. I'm dropping like 30, over 36% of my frames. So maybe I can't go to 60 frames per second yet. So I'm going to downgrade it to 720, 30, go to 30 frames per second. Cause like they just froze again, keep freezing. And um, so I got to figure that out. I got to figure out where that freeze is coming from. That free it coming from. I'm doing something I usually don't do because we got a little bit of time. Because like the earlier I get up, the more time I got because I'm closer to my adventure. Um, I'm going to open up the lines. We're going to do the toast. We're going to open up the lines. We're going to have a little conversation and have a good time. Have a good time. But we are about to do the toast. Salute those ancestors, and which will, which is what we gather here for every day. Things are getting back to normal slowly but surely. And um, I'm just like, man, I'm very, very happy. It, it, the damn thing keep freezing. It just keep freezing. You know, this is when it's times like this. I'll be missing side. I'll be like, damn. I just had <sighs> I'd be like, oh my God, no, Lord have mercy. You know, but you know, um, yeah, he did he did tell me that I could stream through another device and 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 kill some of this buffering, but <sighs> it is what it is. All right, do what we can with what we with what we got. Oh, okay. Now I know why I got it up so high because I was I can't get the best of both both worlds. Y'all see me up there on the screen, and I've been I be listen. I I just sat here and left my TV on down here, and I left it yesterday. That shit streamed from the show all the way to. I got here for actually till after um, I did the interview with uh, Elder um, Bowie and um, Brother Levon. Um, and I'm sitting up here like, oh, my God, I got a lot of videos, got a whole lot of videos. But anyway, it's neither here or there. I want to thank those that's taking the time to toast with us. I know some of y'all kind of confused on the times, but hey. It is what it is, and it is what it's going to be. Um, speaking of that, I need to set up my equipment. So let's go and do this toast. Let's do this toast. Because I got to go and agree today because, you know, I'm trying to do these daily blogs. So, but the lines will be open for a brief time. Um, but just wait till after we get done toasting. Where we at? Okay. All right. It's, all right. it's time for me to, I got the brew, but I got to clear off that table. I clear out that table before I brew. And that means I'm going to have to go on and get get to building that computer. Me and Clear going to have to build that computer. That's the only thing we can do to clear the table. You know what I'm saying? And so that means we're going to have to go on and do another hot damn adventure. I'm trying to keep y'all up on what's going on around here right now. All right, let's see. Let's see. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Okay. Actually. 
Hmm. See, um, part of our family is left out. The Spreaker part of our family is left out. Um, and I don't like that, you know, because Spreaker has been rocking with us for a long time. So I'm trying to figure out how to get Spreaker back in to the full experience. Because at one point in time, Spreaker was, uh, you know, Spreaker, well, I would, I would pull my phone out. And I still got the capabilities of doing that and just streaming straight through my phone. But I don't want to take them back to a point where they don't get to enjoy the music. They don't get to enjoy it. Though. So I am going to figure out how to get Spreaker involved with what we're doing. Um, I just thought about something. Because they do have a function where they, you can integrate Spreaker with. But even then, I don't think. But then again, all right, all right, all right, all right. So I can. All right. All right. So now. You know, y'all see me thinking on there because they got where I can integrate stream or I can integrate stream or no, I can integrate Skype or Google Meets into a podcast. And if I was to do that and capture it in an OBS browser, I might be able to get the sound through. You know, and thank you for bearing with me and allowing me to think through some of these problems, but I don't know if that'll work because I'm not really clear on if the people on the Google Meet will be able to hear everything. Hmm. All right, but anyway, it is what it is. I'm still thinking, but actually... I wonder if I could load all the music into Spreaker and stream Spreaker and record and then upload the record. Ah, all right. Well, anyway, but family, it is what it is. It is what it is. It is. We are where we are. But I'm still I'm constantly thinking about how to improve the quality of the stream. Um, I really don't like, you know, how the image is coming across on here. You know what I'm saying? Because I don't know what happened between my camera, between the house and here. But whatever it is, I don't like it. I don't like it. But it is what it is, once again. All right. But family, here we go. First off, getting out to the creator bar, whatever name you choose to call it. Creator, we lift up our glass. We salute that creator, that great power that makes it possible for us to be here, right? We lift up our glass and we say the mighty word. I say. From there, family, we move on to our ancestors. Our personal ancestors. It'll bring me a great joy every morning to be able, or every day, because I can't say every morning, but every day to get up. And to to in some form or fashion salute our ancestors. Um, it is a good feeling. I love doing it. Um, and I thank those of you who participate in the process, in the ritual, in the ceremony, all wrapped up into one. You know what I'm saying? Those that support the efforts. Um, those that be looking out. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate you 100%, right? And those out there that would like to also support, check us out at um, gnjmedia.support. That's gnjmedia.support. We got the site coming. I got some, oh, we got some stuff coming. We got some stuff coming. I just don't know where all the money go come from. <laughs> but it's coming. You know what I'm saying? It's like it's crazy. It's it's, it's 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 like it's like when I need it, it's popping up, 
right? And it's like, oh, because like I got, because we got the, uh, the, the, the African Deep Thought book coming out. I'm republishing um, a couple of my other books. We got the 21 Day Challenge coming out. I'm working on a children's book, right? Yeah, 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 right? Um, we're working on a game. Working on our own site, we don't. We got our host as ours, right? So that we don't have to. Cause uh, GJ Media Live is still down. Do you believe it? Do you believe it? And also, so what I'm going to be also look into now is finding someone who could build an app that connects all of. Uh, the giamijourney.com, um, the uh, the uh, the site. When we get it, well, I'm gonna wait to get the site. But once the site pop off, because once you get on the site, if I got a, a app that could take you to the site, you better get access to the game. You be able to get access to the, uh, I mean, to literally everything, right? So I'm just trying to have a one-stop shop so you can go on. Those that um, are trying to keep up with the Hot Tim, the, the adventures of Brother Hot Tim that's coming on uh, YouTube. You know what I'm saying? I got three more shows to cut up of that. And, you know, because I was planning. That's why I was getting frustrated last night because I was like, man, all right, cool. Um, seven to eight, right? We're going to do the interview. But, you know, it was like, oh, man. And it took a while, but you know, like I said, sometimes you gotta have patience because we all, we all are still in the learning process. You know what I'm saying? Because, like I said, I, I know, I know um, how difficult it can be. Because when I go to the uh, computer store and I be asking questions and stuff, they be like, "Everybody knows that," you know. So I know, I know how it is to be to be struggling on this shit. So you know what I'm saying? That's why I'm like, "Boom, go and do your thing, other." You know what I'm saying? Do how you do it. As they used to say in the streets a few years ago, get it how you live, right? So we want to we wanna send shots out and give a round of applause to Elder um, Bowie because he, he, he stuck it out. Oh, man. Oh, man, where the sound at? Come on, where the sound at? Is that it? There you go. There you go. Can y'all hear that? All right. So I can run sound through Spreaker. And it picks up my mic. I can run sound through Spreaker. And it picks up my mic. But I can't run any of the music through Spreaker. Hmm. And I got a brand new playlist now because I'm using a different computer. So I got to build up all my music again. Hmm. So I could literally run all of my music through Spreaker. And y'all will be able to hear it on the other side. Let me see if y'all make sure y'all can hear that. Let's let's do a test again. You hear that? It appears to be coming through the desktop. Let's do another test. Let's see. Uh, appears to be coming through the desktop. You know what I'm saying? So, I may have solved the problem. Maybe I'm thinking about it wrong. Maybe the podcast should be on top and the stream on the bottom because I could play the music through Spreaker. I can load all of the same music. Hmm. Hmm. I could use the mic. Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. I'm just thinking, just thinking. I'm just trying to include everybody in. So now, we already toasted the creator, lifting up the creator. 
You know what I'm saying? Because we know the Creator is always present with us. We lift up our glass once again and we salute that Creator. From there, family, where do we go? Y'all know where we're going. We're going to our ancestors, family. We're going to lift up those individuals that lifted us up, right? That made sure that we had, in many cases, safe places to learn how to walk. Safe places to learn how to talk. You know what I'm saying? It taught us to say certain things and when not to say certain things, right? That taught us how to eat and took time to prepare food for us when we couldn't prepare for ourselves. Hell, they took time to 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 to, to take care of us and clean us up when we couldn't clean ourselves. So we want to lift up those individuals that 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 took care of us. Um I, I did, um, I think it was a haiku for my grandfather um, when he was older. And it went along the lines of, you know, you carried me when I um, was younger. And now that you're older, let me carry you. Right? You know what I'm saying? So we do the same for the ancestors. Let us carry you. Right? Let us lift up your memory. Right. Let us awaken you so that you can come um, and dwell with us. Bring us wisdom. Bring us inspiration and power. Right. So we, we going to call on those ancestors. We lift up our glass. We call on those ancestors. Let me put on my my uh, daily toaster screen here. Wow. We we lift up and we pour, as you see on the screen. For our ancestors. Right? Lift up. Um, and I'll start the list. Miles Brown, Miss Ann, Robert and Texana, Davis, Herman Brown, Senior, Rosalie, Tilly, Georgia, William Walter, Christopher Penny, Gaston, Aline, Uncle Chris, Aunt Fiend, Cleveland, and Geneva Brown, Margaret Ellis, Wash Ellis, Cecil Ellis, Alvaro Brown, Gina Gaines, Herman Brown, the second, Barbara Twiggs, Wash Ellis Jr., Katie Ellis, Nikki Ellis, Jamon Jones, Jeremiah Tapper, John Pilar, Montague, Pimpinel, No More, Exit, Pet Ma, Ron Malika Fakur, Dr. Marianne Williams, Kojo Kamal, Elder Farmer, Elder Millie Dixon, Tony Clark, Pastor Yusuf Weston, Elder Ajani, Elder Ron Cole, Elder Robert Donaldson, Alpha Bro, Bro, Actor Jr., J. Edward, Words, Carlisle Harris, Grace Lundy, Inez Harris, William Bill Moss, Phyllis Rose, Sterling and Lucy Wright, Derek L. Pulley, and Alexa Brother, Miss Hila Brooks Crawley, Miss Marie Nelson, Mr. Fred Crawley Sr., Miss Jerry Brunson, Mr. Alonzo Johnson, Miss Marie McDowell, Jenna Foster, Charles Jordan, Kill Smith, Walt Smith, Richard Trigg, Francis Johnson, Mary Franklin, Jimmy Williams. Daniel Ford, George Gibson, Natalie Loretta Clark, Inez McCray, Fritz Clark, Frankie Justice, Katie Justice, Derek Ruderman, Virginia Rogers, Reverend James Smith, Lawrence Henderson, Kevin Spratt, Ling Mary Elizabeth Walker, Raymond Walker Sr., Sarah Jane Carter, Michael Ford Jr., Kelly D. Russell, Susie B. Smith, Teresa Clay, Melvin Hodge, Melvin Hodge Jr., Herman Copeland, Mildred Copeland, Jenny Clay, Bird Beattie, Sarah Ware, Levita Farmer, I go so Sue. I go so Sue, Cheryl Harvey, Aunt Charmaine, Aunt Evelyn, Theodis Hasbury, Harvey Hasbury Sr., Leonard Dickinson, T.C. Islam, Terrell Dunbar, Will Thomas, Sarah Berry, Mark Walsh, Murrow B. Thornton, Pearl G. Thornton, Ida Johnson, Florence M. Carter, Joanne Thornton, Edgar Trisha Lewis, Juanita Wright, Robert Wright, George Wright, Mary Eliza, Frederick Davis, Mary Elizabeth Rogers, Mary Esther, Keechler Reese, Linda Watson Hammonds, Jarrell Giles Watson, Sparrow, Slimmy, Selvin Lewis, Andrew Holmes, Percy Moore, Mildred Owens, Booker T. Bowden, Charlie Hunt, Sammy Stover, Hader Pearson, Sturgeon Thornton, Richard Thornton, Lavina Hall, Freeman Bankston, Mary Moss, Sophia Peacock, Willie Thornton, Napoleon Kenty, Mark Ramsey, Paul Ramsey, Matt Ramsey, David Ramsey, Charles E. Thornton, Frankie Quails, Urania Bar Thornton, Bernice Quails, Ernestine Jackson, Frankie Johnson, Teresa Mormon, Leon Johnson, James W. West Sr., James Parham, Dana Jones, Henry World, James Farmer, Mary Chavez, Leon Grace, Bessie Johnson, Hannah Levester, Mary Moreland, Paul Moreland, Elder Caleb, Rosemary Martinier, Elder Amatel Wellman, Fred Douglas Triggs II, Fina Triggs, Reverend Eddie Moore, Helen Fuller, Eugene Jackson, Eugene Jackson Sr., Francis Johnson, Teresa Mormon, Leon Johnson, James W. James W. West Sr., Dana Parham, Dana Jones, Henry World, Jane Farmer, Mary Chavez, Leon Grace, Bessie Johnson, Hannah Levester, Mary Moreland, Paul Paul Morland, Elder Caleb, Rosemary Martinier, Elder Amitabh Wellman, Fred Douglas Triggs II, Vina Triggs, Reverend, 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 uh, y'all heard me, y'all heard me, I got caught in a mental loop. Um, Elder Amitabh, Fred Douglas, Dama Triggs, Thomas Lula Bay, C. Frank Russell, Frank Russell and David, Fred Douglas, Triggs the second being the Triggs, Reverend Eddie Moore, Helen Fuller, Eugene Jackson, um, 
Eugene Jackson, um, Helen Fuller, Eugene Jackson, Richard Ellis, Alexander, Charles Maxwell, Percy Matt Alexander, Arthur Reynolds, Stanley Lockhart, Ricky Lockhart, William Lockhart, Woodrow Lockhart, Brenda Porter, Deacon Hargrove, Carlos Sawyer, Andrew Parker, Doris Donald, Ellis Murphy, D'Amico Russell, Didi Monet, Gina Ruth Jones, Janet Callahan, um, oh, William Walter West, Nigella Paris, Elder B.C.G. Polani, Jim Robson, Gladys Johnson, Valerie Clark, John and Mary Sullivan, Dirk Johnson, Antonio Johnson, Denise Waters, Dupreetis Hines, Anna's Bostic, Anna Bostic, Winner Priest Scandalberry, Wilson Haley, Emma Hine, Phyllis Lee, Eugene Spradling, Kevin Spradling, Charles Wooden, Penny Brown, Roy Lee, Print Up Jr., Miriam Johnson, Will Belongmeyer, Edith Catney, Janice Carter, Michael Carter, Leon Pina Carter, Margaret Carter, William Carter, Lisa Jordan, Charles Lee Mosley, Dorothy R. Blair, Ransom Evans Sr., Sam Evans Sr., Nalon Blair Sr., Edward Stevens, Swan Stevens, Joe Davis, Timothy Butler, Gene Holmes, Dana Jones, Peter Charles, Christy Nichols, Cardinal Robinson, Rose. Mary Charles, and a pearl Bob Eagles, Zach Wallace, Warren M. Fence, Warren P. Fence, Tim Ingalls, Audrey Fence, William Billingsley Jr., Jennifer Sensiball, Hazel Gaston, Jerry Brantley, Brian Watson Jr., Kaniko Parsons, Jason Kathy Bradford, Thomas Bradley, also known as Uncle Buki, also known as Gypsy, Reverend Roosevelt, Word the First, Stacey Stride, Frank Smith, Mother Bertha, Michael Leonard, David Brown, Ruth Carter, June Cox, Ruth Cox, Paula Cox, Ronald Urban, Judy Hubbard, Irene Johnson, Francis Booth Jefferson, Dan Wilkinson Sr., Emma McClendon, Jerry Doyle, Amina Robinson, Mary Nichols, Patricia Williams, Shabaka Teray, Greg G. Two Gibson, Donna Hill, Richard Glebus, Lee Irby, Tommy Irby, Boy Irby, Jim Gauthier, George and Hallie Johnson, Archie Margaret Armstead, Don Scott, Erica Armstrong, Claire Fox, Jean Evans, R.G. Beck, Adam McGill, Charles McDaniel, Christine Cottrell, I'm Becca, Alice Arnold, Arthur Arnold, Hattie Reed, Charles Reed, Eula and Andrew Baker, Patricia and Edwin Brooks, Gwilin and Bob Hatch, Kimball Vernon, Bradley Kim, Janie Harry, Tom McKay, Spencer Sturgis, Sally Mae Baker, Ethel Baker, Creola Baker, Geneva Baker, Aaron Nino, Baby Hatch, Ed Senior, Mallon Miller, Halsey Hatch, Dad Cleveland, Mother Gibson, Alex Nixon, John Bowie, Lester and Rachel Saunders, Dorita Ross, Riola Ross, Robin Nelson, Francis Stevenson, Leroy Stokes, Neely Johnson, Fletcher Swan, Maddie and Charlie Scott, Ida Casey, Thomas Coper, Vivian Stevenson, Mona Ann Lewis, Cornelia Lyman Lewis, John Jackson, William Dallas Lewis, May Francis, Chappell Jackson, Michael Slade, Joanne Perkins, Richard Jackson, Martha Ford Dawson, Big Mama, Nana Harris, Eva Ford, James Harrison, Margaret Towns, May Williams, Leroy Q. He Sr., Albert Moore, Miss Vanilla, Alvis Motley, Geraldine Elizabeth, Douglas Thompson, Arlington Houston, Lud Alls, Elijah Alls, Jerome Alls, Henry West Staten, Joe Jamel Alls, and Pierce, Donna Carla, Lily Green, Nathan Green, Bad Bond, John Dewey, Ruth Beer, Tim Butler, Raymond Laura Newton, J.B. Foggy, Thomas Noon Sr., Baba Naeem, Jeanette Sanders, J.C. Sanders, Roy Pruitt, H.J. Brownlee Sr., Henry Wilson, Rufus Jenkins, Minnie Wilson, Catherine Sanders, Muriel Ellis, Elizabeth Sanders, Henry Ed Irby, Mildred Armstead, Margaret Armstead, Captain Anthony, Ruby Brown, Charles Walker, Senior Charlie Walker, Cecil Russell, Diane Urban, Harun Phillips, William Ford, Margaret Logan, Phyllis Barnett, Lee Irvin Senior, Michael Urban, Ozella Watson, Hugo Watson, John Carwell Senior, Robert Lee Caldwell, Navea Mitchell, Ron McCormick Senior, Sabrina Easley, Rashawn Easley, Javier McCormick, Robert Ann Reed, Dorothy Ann Reed, John Reed, Shekel Maha Reed Jr., John, uh, John, uh, John Reed Jr., Rich, Patricia Reed, Edward R. Benson Sr., Ethel H. McNair, Lois Fernandez, Jacqueline Broaders, Reginald Alvin, Mazarin Cooper, George Swan, and Monia Grayson, Charles Scott, Charles Ray Scott, Michael Morgan, Shirley Morgan, Sybil Evans McNabb, Annie Ferguson, William Ferguson, Shelby McClendon. We also have those names in our black book. And this is building up so that we will be able to have a list like this. And around Kwanzaa, we're going to get a couple of pages. Um, James Carswell, Liberta Adams. My fault. George, Joella Giles, James Carswell, Liberta Adams, also known as Anshis, Elder Shakramanir, Anthony Brown, Jonathan Ford, Lottie Gaucher, Cousin Tony, Michael Johnson, Dan Jimmy Johnson, Barbara Shang Lewis, Ronald Shell Jr., Damian Top, Christina Banks, Joseph Bingham, Quincy, Mama, Aunt Lady, Abraham Isaac Condom, Aunt Barbara Lewis, Renee Johnson, Joy, Ryan Ross Riggins, Germante, Marcus Price, Ness Words, Marshawn McCarroll, Demetrius Beard, Herb Jefferson, Ralph Mickens, Eric Walker, Quasi Sample, Candace Simmons, Summer Clayton, Leonard Jones, Sonny Garner, Melvin Scott Sr., Elder Clarence Lumpkin, Elizabeth Johnson, Mr. Thorne, Johanna, Jessandra Lynette Lewis, Anderson Mosley, Charles Jordan, Henry S. Sixty Second, Fanny L. Webb, Dan Walton, Al Alti Sue Walton, Emma Walton, James Randolph Giles, Sonny, Pete Walton, William Walton, Fred Powers. We have Elijah Juan Hakeem and Como, Alberta T. Davis, Charles Davis, Willie R. Mackey, also known as Dr. Creamy Mackey, Victor Bowden, Tracetta Kitty Berger, Lucy White, Robert Lee White, Emma Jean White Talton, Roger White, R.L. White, Jesse White, Ruby Jewel White, Justin Carl White, Desi Woods, T.L.R. Woods Lennox, Jim Woods, Lizzie Woods, Juanita Alexander Brown, Cynthia Ann Wright, Richard Dorsey, Annie Simpson, Jamara Simpson, Regina Hopkins, Joseph Simpson, Nettie Dorsey, Eleanor Hopkins, Edward Webster, Alice, um, uh, Alice Webster, Ivy Webster, Arnella Willis, Ethel Lane, Samantha DeMond, Ethel Marshall, Steve Dougie Shelton, William Bill Walker, Carl Rico Johnson, Kim Grace, Stuart A. Johnson, 
Edward Young III, Isaac Jackson Sr., Drusilla Merle, Wayne Young, Christina Young, Thomas Young, Frank Merle, Sylvester Foster, James and Lizzie Winston, Amy and Julia Lawrence, Rosella Leather Sr., Gladys Cope, Rosella Leather Jr., Geneva Jackson, R.J. Lacey, also known as Tooth the Don, Sable Winston, Chris Kenny, Margaret Minter, Mary Smith, Juanita Florine Stith Gibbs, Carl Williams, Carl William, Duncan Jr., Janet Callahan, Danny Hill, Miko D. Nice Hill, Andre Martin, Mabel Williams, Terry Brown, Teresa Biddle, Lavonna Kincaid, Carla Sawyer, Reverend Jesse Porter, Deacon Ezekiel Dennis, Brenda Porter, Craig Lee Jones, Granny Bueller, Papa Al Reeston, Inez Smith, George Gamble Sr., Joseph Garrett, Lashonda, Lashonda Jamar, Leroy Riley, Mona, Yolanda Hunter, Yvonne Patrice Turner, Herman Reeves, Amanda Reeves, Josh Reeves, Lena Kate, Herman Reese, Pam Johnson, Vera and Reese Fisher, Jerry, Jossa McCallop, also known as Mama Moon, Sheila Ann Lee, Panchita Alba, we got Donald Brooks, Barbara Moses, Ida Spate, and Ira Bans um Ira Branson. Man, we lift up our glass once again. As we did it again, family, we made it through the whole process. We raise a glass, and the word we say is, I say. All right, family, let's get to, uh, let's see if this works. I'm checking, testing my scenes while we are here. All right. Oh, oh okay, there it go. All right, cool. All right, so that's the book that's going to be coming out. So, family, we're in the present moment right now. <clears throat> so, we're lifting up our glass to the present moment. And we are toasting. We are toasting the day, which is Coogee Chagalia. For those that don't know why we call it today Coogee Chagalia, you better learn. You about to learn. Let's see if this will do it over here. Uh, let's see if that will work. It worked. You go to freejmjcourse.com. It ain't COVID. You go to freejmjcourse.com, freejmjcourse.com, family, and you can go on and learn why we call the day Kooji Chakalia. You can learn what we're doing, why we're doing what we do. You know what I'm saying? Come on, join the tribe, right? But anyway. Or build a tribe. It's your choice. You know what I'm saying? It's either, 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 right? But anyway, um, we lift up this glass right now for this moment and the power in this moment. Family, every day I ask you, activate your reticular formation. Activate your reticular formation and go out and seek. Let me say it again. Go out and seek your principle. The principle of the day is Kuji Chagalia, family, for those that don't speak the language, for those that don't speak the language, for those that don't speak the language. We don't understand. Once again, freegnjequals.com. But those that do, we know that Kuji Chagalia means self-determination. And this is the principle we seek it. We're seeking out, uh, we're seeking out self-determination. We're also looking for the modern principle of justice, the color is indigo. They say this color is indigo. I'm going to get a darker blue next time. Correspondent is the hermetic. Is the hermetic. Um, male name for the day is Quabina. Female name is Abina. 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 Let me say it right. All right. So we lift up our glass in this moment. We salute our ancestors. We salute the present moment and the power in this moment because this moment belongs to us. And we grow in accordance to how we use it. Let me say that again. We grow in accordance with how we use it. Well, how we use it. So we lift up our glass to salute this moment, to remind ourselves of our power in this moment. Our ancestors had their moment. Our children will have their moment. What you going to do with your moment? We lift up our glass and we say, I say, from there, family, move to our children, our children's children, onto infinity, and we lift up the glass and we salute the children and we say, I say, from there, family, where else do we go? Where where, where, where you going, brother, I tell This is where I'm going to go. 
I'm going to take it very simply, right? From our children to all of our relations. And we lift up our glass and we say, Ashe. From our, all of our relations, we move to um, that selfish toast. This for you. What is it that you need right now to move to you, towards your greatness in this moment? We lift up our glass and we say, Ashe. From here, family, where do we go? It's very simple. Very simple step from here. Family, we're going to lift up that tribe. What's your tribe? I keep on telling y'all tribe up. Hashtag tribe up. Let me put that on it. Hashtag, hashtag tribe up. Hashtag. That was, uh, I'm borrowing that from Shaka's daughter. She threw that out. She threw that out there. Hashtag tribe up. Where your tribe at? Where your tribe at? Right? Um, but yo, we lifting up. Saluting the tribe. My tribe is Giami calling it out. Right? My village is Tawi. Right? Because I told you. A group, a group of people come together and make a family. A group of families come together and make uh, a tribe, I think. I don't know. Yeah, it's tribes. Then uh, a group of tribes come together, I think, and make a clan. A group of a, a clans come together and make a village. A village come together. You make Villages come together and make a city. Cities come together and make a state. State come together and make a nation. It's, it's all a process. Some of y'all want to jump from person to to nation it don't happen like that you don't jump from person to nation from person to family to tribe to clan to village to city to state to nation then to world domination and then we on our way to space the final frontier these are the voyages of the starship Giame, whose five-year-long mission is to explore strange new worlds and pour to the light, pour to the L ancestors every day. All right? We lift up our glass, and um, once again, once again, to that tribe. Giammi for me. I say, from their family, last but not least, I want to lift up my glass to the most magnificent, the most marvelous, the most beautiful, the most powerful, most inspiring individual in the room. Hmm. So they say, I got, I ain't forgot about you. I'm still lifting you up. We got a Facebook, Discord, two YouTubes, Twitch, D Live and Periscope. That's seven. Hmm. Okay. All right. So maybe I might need to start streaming again on Giami on Hot Tim. I don't know. But anyway, lift up our glass. We salute. And we say, I, my fault. I ain't finished toasting you. I ain't finished telling you how magnificent and marvelous and wise. And brave you are. Right? So I'm going to lift up the glass. For those that know. And for those that don't know. I want you to, you know what I'm saying? Embrace who you are. We lift up our glass. We say, I say. I say. I say. Oh, man. The ambrosia, the ambrosia stash is slimming down. Brother going to have to go on and get out here and brew. So I'm going to hold the lines open. The lines are open for a couple minutes because that's how close I am to the adventure now. Um, but let me make sure. I want to see how my new scene looks. I'm going to switch. Uh, I need a transition. I need a dope transition. Hold on. We're gonna find us a dope transition while y'all on while y'all on the air. Let's see. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. We're gonna find us a dope transition. Uh, we're gonna find us a dope transition real quick. Download it. Get it ready. Get it moving. Cause I know I got a couple of them stashed away somewhere. I know I do. So I'm gonna go on and I'm going to go and pull it down 
and 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 pull down this transition and and shock the world. Y'all know, like you say, brother Hot Tip, you got a new computer, so you ain't got no you ain't got no fly transitions no more. What? What? Don't get brother Hot Tim twisted, man. I'm always working on new projects. I always got I don't, always got something hidden somewhere. You know, but I went to my um videos. Some stuff was some stuff was missing. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, where where my stuff go? Where did my scenes go? You know? And they load real slow. I'm like, what's going on here? Down with your you know? There we go. We're gonna download you. Yeah, we're gonna download you. Why is balance so important in our lives? Ooh. Yeah. Use that one. Whoa. But uh Everybody I else? I need one that's just a little bit longer. What? Hold on. We're about to get it. Okay. What else? I know you're like, brother Tim. Why you ain't do this? Why Anybody do know this someone early? who just gives all well, the time? My goal what was to do it earlier, eventually? But I was, uh, what? I got kind of held up How about on the show somebody that night, receives all watch. the time? You know, but it's all what? good. What? Spoil? It's all that's good. a good one. It's all good. Um, Let's see. I know I got some more. I, I got to have more. No? No more videos? All right. So let's go and set up these transitions real quick. All right. So what do you mean by transitions? A transition is... Uh, uh, it's a stinger. A transition. What? Thank you. It's a guru fuck. New mom. Thank you. We got us a new follower, y'all. So the first stinger is I don't know what we gonna call it. Uh, oh crack, not that crack, and not that crack either. Get your mind out the gutter. Get your mind out the gutter, please. Let's see. Um, downloads. Uh, hmm. Today. Well, they got that one. I don't know why crack ain't come up quick. All right, let's see. All right. I'm going to make it uh, 5,000 milliseconds. Let's see. Let's test it. We're going to test it. Let's test it. Mm-hmm. Fade out, transition point, then fade in. Okay, yeah, let's do that. Let's try it. Boom. All right, let's try it. Oh, I called it crack. That's not crack. I'm going to have to change it. Oh, there we go. We got time. We got time. That's all I wanted was a little bit of time. Yep, that's all I wanted was a little bit of time. It look like I'm froze. There we go. All right. So the lines are open. If you want to call in, by all means do. Um, let me make sure I'm on the right screen. Yep. Yep. We on the right screen. All right. Cool. All right. So we are once again back on the Giami Journey timeline. We got a little bit of time to go through it. Now, family, once again, like I was trying to tell y'all last night, but then I discovered on... Um, Restream that when I share the screen, for some reason, they don't make it so that we could communicate when I'm sharing the damn screen. I don't know how smart that is. I'm just, that's just me. That's me talking shit. Uh, introducing our guide to growing your business online. See what steps you can take to build a stronger online presence. Oh, we're going we're gonna to check that out a little bit later on. A little bit later on. All right. Um, we got 24,979 people reached in the last 28 days. That's down 48%. And it's only because of your participation with what we do 
that we are able to even say that. And this is just on Facebook. Facebook is where we get the most hits. So this is why I go to post engagement six thousand four hundred seventy nine in the last um, in the last few days, right? And the only reason that's possible is because of you. You're sharing. You're liking the page. We got twenty three new page likes in the last twenty eight days, and for us. That is phenomenal. Family, the the numbers, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, they saying down, down, down. All I'm saying is shit. If that's down, I'll take it. And the only issue with the ambrosia is that the Nats like it too. And them, uh, I don't know where they come from. But they find it, even in the Black Cave. All right. So let's go down the timeline. For those that didn't have an opportunity to check out... Um, Dr. Reba addressed the village on Kaumba. She did a fine, a fantabulous job. She got 203 views, 14 shares. Oh my God, 35 comments, right? 107 engagements, 327 people reach. Go on, we're gonna have to, Gianni, we're gonna have to get behind that and push that a little bit. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna boost that just a little bit, just a little bit. All right, um, so this morning I'm going through, I'm going through, uh, this morning I'm going through the news, and finally we get some news about how the gaming industry treat their employees. I'm saying it's set up just like regular capitalism, you know, you know, a lot of us, like I'm sitting up here saying, you know, it's, it's a possibility our children getting game programming, hell no. Nah. Not if they not if they ain't making their own games, because this is the issue, family. Look, they treat their workers like shit. And once again, we got the top one percent taking a lion's share and living the scraps for some of the other people. This is from this is an article from Bloomberg. I want us to kind of, you know, take a look at this because family, although because I, I I'm I, I'm not against the games. But what I'm against is the, the 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 practices that take advantage of people and, and their love, right? So you got you got a, a CEO sitting at the top making all this dough, making all this dough. And people are like he took all the risk. No, he didn't. He went and got some goddamn talent. What risk he take? He put up he put up the money. What about the blood, sweat, and tears that you pour into stuff? See, so because because what I want to point out to us is that as we start growing here, Giame, we need to be able to pull each other's tail because we can get simple. It's easy for us to get caught up in this mythology, this American mythology, where we start treating each other wrong and start treating each other like shit. You know what I'm saying? And start start treating each other like employees rather than family members and having real talks. You know what I'm saying? Because because I'm trying to let y'all know that it's coming. I don't know what it is, but it's coming. And when it comes, it's going to be big. Because, and I'm telling you, the ancestors is looking out. The universe is opening up. And I want to make sure that when we go and we are in positions of power, that we remember not where we come from, but who we are. It ain't just about where you're from. Remembering who you are. We got... Let's, let's, I'm, I'm going to try to look at some of this. I'm going to try to look at this. And, and a lot of y'all children, a lot of our young people are really, really into games. Really, really into games. And, you know, we need to let them know what's going on here. Blizzard worker share salaries and revolt over wage disparity. Blizzard workers share salaries. Now, let's see what, what's going on. Employees circulate spreadsheet to compare pay recent raises. You know, see, because this is part of this is part of the, the capitalist idea. You are an island unto yourself. So they get so you have some places that will get upset and maybe even fire your ass if you let people know how much you make. Or some of us feel uncomfortable in letting people know how much we make in some of these places. But one of the only ways that we're going to be able to break down the fuckery and the bullshit. One of the only ways we're going to be able to break down the fuckery and the bullshit is by being very 
transparent, I hate that word, but being, especially when we're dealing with family, about how much we're making. Because it keeps everybody honest. Because now, you know what I'm saying, when somebody making something, in many ways, you got to kind of justify that shit. Hold on. Employees at Blizzard Entertainment, a division of Activision Blizzard, Inc., began circulating a spreadsheet on Friday to anonymously share salaries and recent pay increases. The latest example of rising tension in the video game industry over wage disparity and executive compensation. Now, another interesting thing to look at would be how many of us, how many of us is at Blizzard, even with the wage disparities. But anyway, all right, I, I digress. Blizzard, based in Irvine, California, makes popular games including Diablo, The World of Warcraft. In 2019, after an internal survey revealed that more than half of Blizzard workers were unhappy with their compensation, the company told staff it would perform a study to ensure fair pay. All right, check it out. <laughs> well, hold on, fair pay. Activision CEO gets 40 million while some skip meals. <laughs> Just think about that shit. You sitting up here putting putting the putting putting the 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 algorithms together and putting the programs together, skipping meals, staying late, because you know there is a crunch time for these games because these games got to come out at a certain time. So at first, you know, it's kind of lax, but then they get into this crunch period where they bring more people in and people come in and join the team. And you got constant coding going on. And then after you push right over and have the product develop, they fire a lot of people. Right? So what they do is that they milk the system in the same way that they have accused black folks of doing for a very long time, right? We'll hire you for a minute, and then we'll let you go, and you can get that unemployment. Or or you can get back into the system how you were. You could become a burden on society because, you know what, we no longer need you. <laughs> well, I'm going to the bank with $40 million. All right, but anyway. Blizzard worker were unhappy with the compensation. The company told staff it would perform a study to ensure fair pay according to people familiar with the situation. Blizzard implemented the results of that study last month, which led to an outcry on a company internal Slack messaging board. One employee then created a spreadsheet and encouraged staff to share their compensation information. The anonymous document reviewed by Bloomberg News contains dozens of purported blizzard salaries and pay, pay bumps. Most of the raises are below 10%, significantly less than blizzard employees said they expected following the study. Our goal has always been to ensure we compensate our employee fairly and competitively. You heard that shit? That's how they get you, right? You, you, you always got that smooth tongue individual that comes out and, and says just the right. We always try to make sure we take care of our employees. This year, Blizzard, top performers received a salary increase that was 20% more than in prior year. And more people got promotions. Taylor Adder, over our overall selling investment is consistent with prior years, she also said. Hmm. Was the CEO's bonus part of the consistent? Was it consistent with prior years? I'm just asking. Wage disparity has become a hot button issue in a $150 billion video game industry as calls for unionization grow. So they, they are fighting unions. This is why they bring you in and let you go. They don't want nobody to get stable enough to where they can really, really start um, um, organizing, you know what I'm saying, organizing to actually start fighting, to start getting a fair pay, right? We need to, see, because a lot of us have fantasies. We live in fantasies. Well, I wouldn't want nobody telling me how much I could make. Get up out your goddamn fantasy and get into reality. 
because the world that you allowing to dream and you you most of us never make that type of money where we can sit up here and be like, well, you know, I I don't want them to tax me like that if I had the money and I wouldn't want nobody to tell me how much I can make if I had the money. If, 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 that's always the goddamn term and shit when we looking at this shit. Not realizing that your ifs is slapping your children in the face. Just like our parents' ifs Slap are slapping us now. Stop with the ifs. You in the moment. Where are you at? Well, if I no, where are you at? Right? You where you at? Cause most of us don't make enough money where I mean, cause you know, I, I be cause one now cause cause you know, people be like, brother, I tell you, why don't you why don't you make uh, 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 Giami a nonprofit organization? Because I don't think black folks need more charitable organizations. I like to exchange. I like to exchange some type of service for what I do. Right? Um, because many of us exist in the if reality. If I get this crap. If. 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 A whole existence is based around if. If only you knew those bills were due. Y'all killing me. We got to get up out the if and get into the reality. See, because this is what I'm talking about when I be talking about like my eye, right? You know what I'm saying? Being able to distinguish the real from the unreal. Many of us get so caught up and we you we 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 know it by heart, but we don't we don't apply this shit to life. My art is about reality. It ain't about no, you know what I'm saying? We be coming up with all this uh, being able to distinguish the real from the unreal. If it's not real. Our politics is based on if. The economics in our community are based on if. The education of our children is based on if. When we going to start doing dealing with now? This is why we pour every day. I, I try to pour about now. And I know I know this is kind of off top topic, but it is based on topic. Because stuff like this happens. Because not only are black folks caught up in if, but so is a lot of white people. If. As a matter of fact, they use if to justify. Or, ju they, or they used if to justify the murder of many a black man. If. Only you knew. Your bills were due. Y'all lucky I can't sing for real. If. Ways to stay. And that song was, that song is, I mean, I want you to think about the, the narrative of that song. It's all about a fantasy that a woman is having in her mind. If you only knew. It ain't, you know, he knows that I love him. If he only knew, what would he do? She can't face reality. This dude probably running around on her. If he only knew, what would he stop? If, if, no, it ain't no if. Leave if at the door. We dealing with reality. I'm sorry. Um, Wage disparity has become a hot button issue in a $150 billion video game industry as call for union, union, unionization grow. A pro-labor group recently slammed Activision Blizzard for the pay of Chief Execu Executive Officer Bobby Kotick. His 2019 compensation was worth $40 million at the end of that year. How many, how many lunch meetings this motherfucker done had? And he got people at his job eating bologna. Skipping meals, staying up late. How much sleep he missed? And 
ain't talking about sleepy mess because he was he was out uh uh cavoiding around right come on man i mean do y'all really honestly believe that some of these ceos really earn this money do we really do we really believe that or have we been if if it was me <laughs> come on man last year the company also paid 15 million in stock awards and a sign a on bonus to incoming chief financial officer Dennis Durkin these are circles of friends putting money they are practicing reciprocity in their small circle let's be clear let's be clear in an ominous spreadsheet one employee listed the ceo's annual salary bonus and stock award in internal messages reviewed by bloomberg news blizzard employees said they were struggling to make ends meet while watching activision blizzard revenue grow year after year some producers and engineers at Blizzard can make well over some engineers at Blizzard can make well over a hundred thousand a year, but others, such as video game testers and customer service representatives, are often paid minimum wage or close to it. Do I need to read any more? Blizzard Entertainment has traditionally remained aut autonomous from its parent company, but in recent years, Activision Corporate Office has pushed the game development studio to cut cost. Hmm. To cut cost. Ain't it funny how they talk about cutting costs, but at the same time, they be giving out these packages to their boys. Giammy, we got to do it, man. Giammy, we got to do it. Ain't no choice. Because nobody taking, nobody looking out for us. Last year, the company eliminated hundreds of jobs and asked some of the remaining staff to take on the responsibility of those who were let go. I'm going to fire Frank, Steve, and Johnny. And guess who I got to help me? You. And you're not getting extra pay. Well, I'll give you a dollar an hour. Hmm. Hmm. The extra work did not come with money pay. With more pay, I was I didn't even read that shit. I already know how the hustle go. According to the people familiar with the company, who asked not to be identified, discussing sensitive, sensitive private information, one veteran Blizzard employee told Bloomberg News they received a raise of less than fifty cents an hour. They are making less now than they did almost a decade ago because they are working fewer or fewer overtime hours than they did back then. Several former Blizzard employees said the only they only received significant pay increases after leaving for other companies, such as nearby rival Riot Games, Inc. in Los Angeles. In 2018, messages on internal Blizzard communication channel reviewed by Bloomberg News Employees talked about money-saving measures they've taken to remain with the company. So you got people that are so loyal to your brand that they will sacrifice. Come up with ways out of no ways to keep your brand alive. And you turn around and slap them in the face and give somebody a $40 million boost. They care how many employees they got. They couldn't take 20 million and distribute that through the office 20 million hold on another said see we have allowed we have allowed greed to run rampant in our hearts right many was dreaming about this they ain't working hard she ain't working hard now, anybody that know anybody that 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 is like, uh, what 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 is called a secretary, right, a personal assistant. They know the whole in and out of the business. I don't know why. See, 
Do you know why they call a secretary a secretary? Do it. Secretaries are called secretaries because they were known as keepers of secrets. That's sec. That's why you got a secretary of state, the keeper of secrets. That's what the secretary is. She knows where everything, or he knows where everything is, and how everything runs. And you don't pay those people right. Mm. All right. Good luck. And also, and what's really what's really scary is when you find out that what where the word janitor come from. But anyway, how important they are because it makes a whole lot of sense when you look it up. Look up Janice, by the way. Another said they would only eat oatmeal and hold on. So these these people got one employee wrote that they had to skip meals to pay rent and that they used the company's free coffee as an appetite suppressant. Another said they would only eat oatmeal and bail on team lunches because they couldn't afford to buy food at the company. I can't read this shit no more. All right. Y'all going back. Y'all going to read that. Um, I, I can't. I, that, I mean, that, 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 that's loyalty to foolishness. You know what I'm saying? They don't give a damn about you. Y'all need to go. Some y'all need some of y'all need to go on. And, and and create it. I'm looking for somebody to create a game for GMA. How about that? All right. Uh, Trump says U.S. should get slice of TikTok sale. So first off, homeboy pissed off at TikTok because the young people done played his ass. I don't know if y'all know. Y'all need to catch up on the news. And now he trying to extort Microsoft, which couldn't afford to be extorted and shit. I want my cut too, goddammit. Let's just say it. This from the Wall Street Journal. Trump says U.S. should get slice of TikTok sale price. Boy, he got a lot of, I mean, he he got balls for days. I mean, he just don't get, he don't get tired of just saying dumb shit. It's just like, ew. I mean, it's like, could you imagine having to work and clean some of the shit up he's saying? You got to be just as ignorant as his ass. You, you know, I, I'm just saying. All right, family. Hey, why, you know, they rushing to put the schools back together. We need to chill. This is my post. We need to still chill. Stop rushing to get back to what we knew and start looking for what can be. That's different from if, motherfucker. Because I know y'all, you just got to talk about. That's different. I ain't say if. What can be, what could be created from this moment that can take our children to another level? That could take our lives to another level. Let me tell you something, right? Do you know that most of your children are grouped in schools by age and not by skill? Unless you're paying money. Your children are being grouped by age only and not by skill. And they're held with a group, regardless of their skill level, and moved with this group in most cases. And most schools try to keep these groups together, these age groups together. During this time, while we are doing digital learning, do you not know that it is a prime opportunity to start teaching our kids at their skill level? Because we ain't got to worry about nobody's feelings. We ain't got to worry about nobody's self-esteem. If you in the eighth grade and you only doing math at the third grade level, you could go to a third grade classroom and nobody ever see your face. You could catch up and master your third grade math. And I know some of y'all out there laughing and shit, but let me be honest with you, family. If you don't master the basics, it don't matter what grade you in. You always going to struggle. And we have kids that will rush through trying to keep up with a goddamn test. Rush through. Group with, for age and not necessarily skill. Now, let me tell you the other thing that happens when you put individuals together by age. What you do is you stress out teachers. What do I mean, Brother High Tim? So, if I have a classroom and I got three high achievers... 
Let's say I got 25 students. I got three high achievers, right? And I got seven that are behind, right? Two that are super behind. So that's seven and two. That's nine and three. That's 10. And I got 15 in the middle. All in very different places. How do I deal with that? Oh, well, you're supposed to separate them into groups and you're supposed to differentiate the teaching and you're supposed to move from group to group rather than separating the kids into their group levels, into their skill level, because if you have a group of kids that are behind in your school, right, you got, you got it in every class. You group them all together. You group third grade learners together fourth grade learners together and you start educating them where they are regardless of whether you do third grade math and you are in kindergarten and you do third grade math and you in eighth grade there should be a class where both third grade purse people can get the skills that they need we're so bent on make trying to make i mean we want to make people feel good you know what make people feel good Victory. Yeah, chilling with my friends feel good, but you know what feel better? Victory. When I actually get some shit and I can actually figure out how to use it, that shit feels better. That's, I mean, that's, 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 sec that's for me, that's second to sex. I'm just saying. You know what I'm saying? Just the, 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 the being able to master some shit and really, and get that aha moment. And I feel sorry for you if you never had that aha moment. That is like an orgasm. And if you ain't had it, if you don't understand, you don't matter. You haven't mastered the basics. <laughs> you robbing yourself. Those aha moments. I don't know if you ever had one where it's just like it, it flows all over your body. And you be like, oh, shit. Oh, shit, I need a cigarette. Oh, God. Second and sex. I'm just saying. So, let's, you know, it feel good to chill with my friends, but nothing beats victory except sex. Just being honest. I want to give kids victories. I want to work with them where they are. Because when we start being honest with our children, when we start being honest with ourselves, we can start being honest with our children. Like some of y'all talking about, y'all telling y'all kids you don't accept B's when you was a goddamn D student all the way through. Get the fuck out of here. You know what I'm saying? You don't accept. You know what I'm saying? You only, you expect excellence and your ass sleep at work. Get the fuck up out of here. You, know, you 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 come to school high talking about I want you or honor. Get the fuck out of here. But anyway, I digress. Digress. Um, I'm sorry. I ain't even. Is anybody listening to this shit? Lines are open 614-556-4535. Um, what's up, Miss Miss Sambu? Keep her secrets. Oh, she on here. That's not dumb. That's U.S. shit ban TikTok. The U.S. shit brilliant group by skills. Right. I'm just sitting up here like, yo. I mean, and this is a primary time. Rather than trying to rush kids back to what we had, let's take them to where they need to be. Let's take them to where they need to be. You know, because a lot of people are like, well, you can't learn. You can't learn online, then tell me how your son is, is mastering levels on video games. Please, somebody tell me. If you can't learn online, right, then tell me how your baby is able to pick up the remote and find what she want on YouTube. That's not learning. Is it just me? Or is are we, I mean, are we double, we, we, we speaking with a split tongue? We, be honest. Let's be honest and be honest with teachers. And be honest, 
We need you to babysit. Just be honest with them. We're paying you to baby. Just be honest. I don't, it, it, it's not about my child's self-esteem. It's about my self-esteem. I want to feel that I did good. So since I couldn't go to college, I want to force them into college, even though they have a, they have a knack with their hands and they could build shit incredibly. Hmm. Same on us. So we're so quick to want to get our children back in the day. I mean, into school. Right. In certain certain places. Right. That we um, were forcing something to happen that don't really need to happen right now because we don't know enough about this virus or whatever the hell it is, because I, I know I got some conspiracy people. Don't live. So whatever you want to call it or whatever the fuck, I'm not arguing. We don't know enough. We, we don't know enough. Right? So it's best to err on the side of safety than to rush in. And even worse, to put our children on the battlefield. This is cowardice at its height. You're going to put your children on the battlefield. It ain't even a battlefield that they want to go to. Now, I can understand if the children wanted to go to the battlefield because all the children don't want to go to the battlefield. Some of the children that get smart enough to be like, this shit don't make no sense. I don't know what it is. I know, but I'm hearing people dying. And I don't want to die. In the civil rights movement, you had young people where they said, listen, young people, we need your help. And the young people came and volunteered to be on the battlefield. It's a difference. You sending your we sending our children to fight something that we don't know. We're rushing because we want to get the economy back together. I had a uh, surveyor call me, and they hung up on me because one of the answers I gave they said, "What do you think is more important, the economy or people?" I said, "People." Click. People are the economy. Don't get caught up with the math nerds. But let's go and look at what's going on with some of these schools. I got to get up out of here in a second. As coronavirus comes to school, to a school, wait. As the coronavirus comes to school, a tough choice when to close. And the tough choice is when to open. Call Black, uh, Black Line is open, 614-556-4535. Once again, the Black Line is open, 614-556-4535. Yep, I'm doing something new. I got a little bit of extra time, you know. Got a little bit of extra time, you know. Call in, hold Brother Hot Tim up. Let me see. Hold on. Who is this? What am I on? Is this New York Times? There we go. What I just signed up for? Now I'm feeling bad. The hell? Oh, man, I hope they ain't get me for another $7. All right, because you know New York is quick. They ain't. All right, here we go. As schools in the South and the Midwest reopen this week, officials must decide what steps to take as staff members and students test positive. Look at the hallway. Look. What else could you assume is going to happen? You know some of these, especially these older kids, they they've been talking with their little girlfriends on the phone every day. You don't think they dropping mass protocol? I would. Come here, girl. Come on, let's go behind the bleachers. 
Come on now. You don't come on, man. It's like, you know, so they're young, they're exuberant, they they're gonna do what do you expect? And then you think you think kindergartners and first graders is gonna be walking around like this and not touching each other? I have to deal at least seven times a day with somebody touching somebody that they wasn't supposed to touch on a normal day. Now, what happens when we put up rules and say, hey, you ain't allowed to touch nobody? They children, they're going to they're gonna test the boundaries. And you don't know enough about it. But you need daycare. We need daycare. We need we need to make sure these kids are somewhere so we could get people back to work. Rather than looking at other possibilities. More than 200 employees have been barred. Barred. Where you at, Digo? Get up. Wake up. Barred. What? What did it say? Did it just say something to me? It just said something to me about signing in. Oh, I'm on a different computer. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm on a different computer. All right. I had to change computer for those that's new out there. If you notice, hopefully the graphics is a little bit better for you. Things it ain't it ain't as smooth because I'm trying to do 60 frames per second and I'm not um, podcasting right now. But hold on. A high school in Indiana had to shift to online learning after just two days. And students in Mississippi, Mississippi, goddamn, were forced to quarantine after classmates tested positive for the coronavirus during the first week of classes. The new academic year is all to a chaotic, chaotic start as schools open in some parts of the country while infections continue to rage. Do I need to read any farther? Y'all gonna read that. Y'all gonna finish reading that. I mean, it gets so, you know, it's it's like sitting on, it, it, it gets frustrating. It's like, this is stupid. And sometimes you be wondering, who, on oh, my fault, Linus was right. The great pumpkin has risen to prominence. The great pumpkin and his followers are ruling the country. Linus warned all of us and those that don't know who, who I'm talking about, you're obviously too young. Linus was Charlie Brown's best friend. They had a whole damn show where Linus was talking about the Great Pumpkin. And the Great Pumpkin was coming. And the Great Pumpkin never came. But I knew that the Great Pumpkin was going to show up one day. And guess what happened? He ended up in the White House. The Great Pumpkin. Yes, he is. He's here. He's running shit. And I'm starting to think that Mitch McConnell might be Linus. I swear to God. I swear to God. If, if, it, if somebody do some research, I'm quite sure that somewhere in Mitch McConnell's name, Linus, might be there. Because that is his number one disciple. Somebody on the line. Go ahead. Who is it? Hey, it's Kim. What's going on? Uh, nothing much. Um. Hanging here in Chicago. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Well, welcome, welcome back home. Yeah, it feels good to be back home. I'm glad to be among my sisters and brothers. What's going on? What's going on? Hit us up. Uh, no, I was just happy to be listening to you this morning. And um, you said some really great stuff. So I want to, first of all, say, you know, I love the fact that when you talked about school based on class, based on skill. Um, I don't know if you saw in the comments, I said, that's brilliant. We don't do that. We just do social promotion. And, um, you know, we've been doing it for a number of years. So, yeah, if we could figure out a way to do online, even if people, like, they're talking about doing pods. I know mm -hmm. a lot of been doing these learning pods, and, you know, I'm not really in favor of it, just to say that. But an online learning pod would be great to supplement um, what's going on in the schools. That would be great, and I would, you know, support something like that, but not a learning pod where you get a group of people who can afford to pay uh, $500 a month per kid 
or more, and then you hire someone to come to your house and teach your kid, or a group of people do that. I'm not in favor of that because I think that undercuts the public school system. And whatever we want to say about it, it is the public school system that actually enabled us to advance. Mm -hmm. I mean, a lot of people disagree with me, but I just don't think we should, you know, give this up that easily. So I'm not in favor of that, but a supplemental learning part I'm in favor of. So I just want to throw that out there. And I'm going to say something that I normally don't say online because it's like, uh, I don't want people thinking negative of me, but I just feel like right now I'm going to say it. I think part of the problem in the U.S. with this coronavirus has brought out that we have a parenting crisis. And it's not just mm. among black. It's not just among white. It's mainly just whites and blacks. I'm going to say it. It's mainly just whites and blacks. We have a parenting crisis. Um, we, we, we don't parent well. Therefore, our kids lack self-control. So you're right. They're not going to social distance because they don't have self-control in school. We're pushing to, to, to we're pushing the politicians or we're pushing to open up schools because we have a parenting crisis. Because the kids are at home not being parented. Because if you look across these big cities, they have a rise in juvenile crime. They're not putting them in jail, though. They're giving them a slap on the wrist and sending them home in most mm. of the major cities, okay? Because they don't want their numbers to go up. You know, they stop suspending kids because they don't want the numbers to go up with suspension in a lot of these major cities. But the, we have a group of people who don't know how to parent. And uh, instead of telling them, you don't know what you're doing, we just placate them and we change Ooh. things with the system. And we, we push things on teachers. Wait, and we say, stop, 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 okay, I'm stop. Sorry. I, you got to get the thunder for that, girl. We just placate <laughs> them. We can't, I mean, it's, it's like being professional means being a liar because you can't tell a motherfucker. Your child is sitting right here with me because you don't know what the fuck you doing. Thank you. Thank you. You can't say that. So you got to be nice. And and, and, and you have to, I mean, you I, You could be sitting in a, in, in a meeting with somebody high as hell and still have to placate them because it's supposedly the professional thing to do because we're not really Thank allowed you. to be honest. And I, I agree. You. We do have a parenting crisis because especially as ADOS and poor, because we, we can include, we can include uh, uh, poor white people in this, but we had to be, we have always been programmed to work. Period. That mm -hmm. would, that is the main, family is not the main thing. Work is. Where's your work ethic? The American work ethic. Sure. This is where sure. it led us to. Because family fell in through the cracks on this. But go ahead. Somebody, yep. somebody, somebody else on there? Go ahead. No, it's just me agreeing with you. <laughs> so no, I'm just... And I'm Go ahead. I'm going to add in, I know this is about ADOS, and I'm all about ADOS, but the parenting crisis is not just us. It's an American problem. I've taught, like you know, I've taught overseas. So I've taught kids who are parented by white people. White kids are, or, or mixed kids who are parented by white people. They may not be white, but they're parented by white people. And I've taught kids who are parented by Black people, ADOS teacher, people. And I'm going to tell you, it's a crisis. It's an American crisis. <laughs> okay? The only difference with them is they have safety nets. They have a whole society rallying behind them. So even if there's a crisis along the way, they have saw all these things that will still support their kid. So they can be horrible parents. But the kid will still turn out to be functional in the society that they created. Mm. We're horrible parents, but we got the society attacking us every step we make. If we make us wrong move, that's it for us. We can't afford to be terrible parents. And we knew that a long time ago, but somehow we forgot it. I don't know exactly how this happened. Maybe somebody knows, 
We have had a parenting crisis for a number of years, and I believe this coronavirus has made, and now they don't know what they're going to do. So put them in school, and, and let the, the system has to do it because the system has been doing it. Well, guess what? They can't be in school. <laughs> you still there? I'm here. Okay. I'm here. All right, let's see what's on. Let's see what's next. Because you know I ain't did this in a while. Um, the food, uh, CNN's uh, article, the food, the U.S. food system is killing Americans. So not only are we bad parenting, we have very unhealthy people in this country. Huh. We do. We've mm. known it for a long time. They've been doing that. It? Obesity is a public health crisis. Violence is a public health crisis. This stuff has been textbook material since like the freaking seventies. Okay, this ain't nothing new. Nothing. They know it. Nothing so, new. just for just to let y'all know, I got a new blog popping off. Um, got a new blog popping off, and it's is a it's a vlog, not a blog. So I do a little. I, I'm just writing just a little bit, but of course I do what I do. And I'm just, I got a camera and I'm running around. Um, so, uh, you know, just my life. Doing what, um, to call it the adventures of Brother Hot Tim. And I posted all these. They wouldn't supposed to be posted up at this point in time. So, uh, last night we had Brother um, Elder Clifford Bowie and Warrior LeVar yeah, Cobb. Did it, you say who? Did you have problems with it? I tried to watch it in the beginning and there were so many problems. Right, well. First off, this what I was using. I'm I wasn't able to use. I, I'm not using the regular program because I want people to oh. see who presenting. But uh, he couldn't get online, and then I found yeah. out in the midst of the program that when I go and share my screen, that they allow you to share your screen, but you can't speak while you sharing your screen. Which I'm I, I wrote them a letter. But I don't understand. Is this some? Is this a joke? Is this y- y- y'all just yeah. playing? Why would you share a screen when you can't comment? Why you can't sense. comment on the screen you sharing? What kind of foolishness is that? Then but I do. What's the point in sharing? Exactly. You know what I'm saying? But hey, it's cool. It is what it is. Um, and I was struggling, and then the elder couldn't get on. <laughs> he couldn't get on with his computer, so he took oh. his phone and he started using his phone. To show what it what it what his presentation was, and I'm like, hey, get okay. it how you live. You know what I'm saying? Just you know, I'm 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 like I said because I understand. I know, like I said, I know what it feels like, um, to kind of be not lost, but to be in a situation where everything goes wrong. Computer's not working oh. right. The sound not. I understand. So I have patience. Even though I, because I was planning on getting outside, but as soon as I got up out of, out of here to go outside, it was raining. I was, I was like, ah. Mm. Now, where are you in the basement now? Well, I mean, I, you, you ain't got to. You go made a studio in your basement. You ain't got to be screaming it all out. <laughs> I'm in the black cave. That's where I'm at. Oh my bad, my bad. The black cave. You see right. the brick? It's a, it's a cave. It got rocks and stuff. I'm. A, I need some oh, more rocks. Yeah. Now I'm about to bring you exactly. got me subcon. Yeah, I'm in the basement now. Okay. So that's you cool. I mean, so you made a studio in your basement. Nice. Yeah, I'm trying. I'm I'm trying. I ain't, I'm I'm not done yet. We're not done yet. I'm you know, so but so tonight we are going to be showing the Great and Mighty Walk um by um uh, uh a movie done by uh Wesley Snipes. I'm in Raw Productions about uh, the the great historian, Dr. Oh, man, his name slipped my mind. Somebody help me. John Henry Clark. John Henry Clark. So come check it out. Um, It will be. It'll be at 7 p.m. Be looking out on the on, on. the timeline because I'm gonna be posting up the I'm gonna be posting up the um the link because of course I'm not gonna stream it because it's that's a private movie I ain't trying to have that beef 
but we will be watching it in um in the room. So um I'll be posting up a link so that people can go and check it out with us. All right. So that'll oh, be the night. Huh? I just thought about it. I thought I thought about something I wanted to share. Go so ahead. Important. Uh, I it's so ironic, but but the ADOS uh people here in Chicago uh -huh. happen to be headquarters like in my neighborhood. <laughs> they happen so to be ironic. what? Headquarters in my neighborhood. What? Like, I mean the the neighborhood where you grew up? No, the neighborhood where I live. I didn't grow up in Chicago. The neighborhood where I'm living now. Okay. So I hooked up, I link, I was going to link up with them anything, anywhere, but that's so ironic. And the uh, they managed to get a church, 801 Chicago has a headquarters now, Avalon Park Community Church. I live in Avalon. And um, Reverend Anthony Williams started to do a hunger strike last weekend. You said he a hunger strike? Hunger strike. Hunger strike. He what is the goal of the hunger strike? Because I, 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 the I pray that... The goal of the hunger strike is to um, get them to pass a bill to make violence a public health problem. And so he That's set doable. up in a tent in Chicago, and um, he's sleeping in that tent, and he's not eating. He's had to press a number of times. They've come, he's been on the radio, Fox TV has been there more than any other TV station. And um, so I'm just sharing that with you guys. I don't know if you want to look him up on Facebook or ADO at Chicago or um, Anthony Williams. I could also share some stuff on the Giamme, in the Giamme group. Please do. Or, or I mean, on the I page. The, you know, the group is private. So y'all be having oh, all, types of, all types on of crazy conversations in the in the private group so if you're not in the private group you better go and try to get in because they be having the real talk that but you can post it on the page go and get an interview with them post it up okay yeah that's what i was thinking that would be great so i don't know how we would do that logistically but i'm quite sure you know how to do it right if you now if you want to if you want to do the interview you can record it and you can get it to me and i'll post it up if you want me to do the I interview, I don't want to do it. I don't think I want you to do it. I think you would ask better questions and stuff than I would. Stop. And I'm too kind of scattered. I know, really, I'm too scattered. Right? I'm renovating my house at the same time, I can dig so it, I can't even. Sister Kim, yeah. but you, how are you going to say that you? I'm, I'm. Listen, scattered. That's the wrong word to use when you're dealing with brother. Scattered. Have you heard no, one of my presentations? Scattered. I'm scattered. No, you, I'm talking about no, but you already know what that's me. I, you you saying you're oh, scattered. <laughs> you know? So but yeah, I mean like I said, if you can if you can range it, um, because all he needs is a phone. Cause we could do the black that's line. All, he has it. He has it. So I'm gonna try to get over there this week and um talk to him. I also talked to the ADOS Chicago. Uh, chairperson mm -hmm. and um and let's see about um maybe you know how the people feel about it and he probably be all right with it but marlon you probably if you listen to your vet or tony they always reference him marlon um on their shows he's a pretty cool guy okay. so um yeah that that would be that would be great if you could interview him I'll do that i ain't got no problem with it just let me know now this week is gonna be hard because i'm gonna be doing the comedic new year Cause I'm I'm mm -hmm. packed all the way up until the eighth, but then after that, I got uh, and we're gonna have a little bit of time, and then like I said, I got a little bit of time in the morning now where I can talk to my people. So I'm gonna start letting people okay. know we're gonna have a call in in the morning. Y'all have any news that y'all want, brother? How Tim to cover? Y'all need to go and let us throw it up on the timeline so we can cover it. Let's see what's next. So there, there's the, the schedules up there. We got brother Marcus Garvey say you cannot grow beyond your thoughts. If your thoughts are those of a slave, you will remain a slave. Oh, man, you get the thunderstrike for that, Brother Marcus. Come out here making fun of me, Clee. Why are you by my closet? Some who? Uh, it's probably over here behind behind that over there. But anyway, it's real life at Giami. I try to keep it real with y'all. Um, yesterday's show was, it, uh, we still got 13 views, 14 people reached. Um, but it was, it was real messed up because I came downstairs and nothing was working. 
And the only thing I did was pull out the headphone cord. And I keep on telling y'all that Microsoft made a change that was so subtle that I pulled the headphone jack out of my out of my computer and it stopped it stopped broadcasting on let, let me put it this way I lost total sound so it took me about three hours to get it together but I got it um your diet is not only what you eat this is up on the this is on the page feel free to join us on Gmi journey um your diet is not only what you eat hold on let me get to the just case and how will you how will Shamar and Keila what they're gonna do Kwame they're gonna do the they're gonna do it the same way that they their homeboy did tonight um yesterday same thing call I mean I got it's the same link I will send them the link just like I it's the same link um your diet is not only what you eat it's what you watch what you listen to, what you read, and the people you hang around. Be mindful of the things you put into your body, emotionally, spiritually, and physically. Excellent, excellent. Army Guard begins to reorganize force into eight divisions to prepare for possible fights with Russia and China. What in the hell is going on? We going we talk about that a little bit later. Oh, in a moment, there's two things I forgot before I get up out of here. Uh, of course. Um, in the moment, I forgot to talk about in the African Deep Thought Workbook. Um, this is by Terasali M. Shiganji. It'll be coming out soon. Oh, I don't know if y'all seen it. Let me see if I, let me, let me let y'all see the cover real quick. Let y'all see the cover. I'm, I'm, I'm working. I'm not playing at all. I'm not playing at all. Here it go right here. Here it come. Here it come. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, there it go, right there. There it go, right there. That's that's it right there. That's it right there. So now we can just switch right back. All right. Um, Let me go back. It said, if all is at 7 p.m., then they will go before the JHC show. What's JHC? Oh, my God. Yeah, man, I forgot. Now I understand what you're saying. Yeah, they're going to no. know. Um, they are going They're going before John Henry Clark. So they part of the program. So um, you just threw it. Oh, man, y'all throwing curveballs at me, man. Y'all throwing curveballs at me. So they're going to have to get on the, um, they get on, they're going to get on the, um, the Google Meets, and they'll present. Oh, no, 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 no. I'll open up the room, and I'll start the movie after, right? Because I can stream. Well, even if I'm streaming in the room, the people in the room won't be able to see what's being streamed. So we could stream them. All right, this is Brother, for Brother Kwame. Once again, problem solving on air, so family, forgive me. Brother Kwame, we will start the show at 7. They will stream with the link that I sent out because the world needs to see that. Then we will then, but I will have the room open for people to go into uh, and they could start having discussion if they don't want to see what they're talking about, which I, you know, and then after that, we will announce that we are will be moving into the private room and that will give me an opportunity to post up the link so that other people that's on the outside can get in and check out the movie. How'd that sound? How'd that sound? See, you know, get give give brother hot Tim a round of applause. That was that was that, that was that, that, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Thank you, man, thank you. Thank you. So we just scream. Through the link that I used yesterday, starting at 7 p.m. Uh, at the same time, I will open up the room for people to start gathering in the uh, 
in our meeting. After the meeting, I will be able to go over once they start talking and let people know that they can go on and watch these young people and then come back. And we will wait for people and we'll start the movie right after they get there. All right. So. Proverb for the day. One. Proverb, first chapter, 16th, number 16. The divine loves humanity and has filled it with its sight so that humanity might see how to be joined with the divine, said the knowledge holders, and to conquer all enemies. Damn. So last one, yesterday he gave us the secret to immortality. Now he's given us the secret to being able to conquer all enemies. The sacred laws have been formulated by for salvation and for the support of humanity, said the knowledge holders family. So, this book we will be using on Ujima Nights because the book is almost done. So, um, be sure to get your copy. It's a life changing book. Um, that because this is this is the African Deep Deep Thought Workbook and is based on. My number one book, the number one book that I love, this is the African openness to the tree of life. So this book is based, this book is the workbook for this book. So you'll be able to join us on Ujima and keep up. And it's going to be a beautiful digital book that you'll be able to write notes up in and everything. All right. Um. Also tonight we have, oh man, All right, we might have. Folk Tales for Grown Folks. All right, so here we go. The Bear and the Two Travelers. Ooh. Ooh. I don't think we're going to have a show tonight because of Great and Mighty Walk and the discussion. So, uh, but, so for our... For next week, we the the proverb or, or, or the folk tale for the week is the bear and the two travels. Now, those that don't know what I'm talking about, for those that are doing the 21 Day Angusa Saba Challenge, that book will be also dropping soon. Those that will be joining me on the 21 Day Angusa Saba Challenge or will be wanting my sisters on the 21 Day Angusa Saba Challenge, we have a proverb a day and we have a folk tale per week. Right, so and both of those are generated by the show that we do. All right, um, so all right, let me go on and finish up. So, y'all heard we might be having the lines open more often in the morning. You said, You said, send you the link also. Don't you be, don't you be jumping in there and interrupting them kids, them kids' show, man. I'm just messing with you. All right, so we had our poor Ankh. Uh, Dr. Reba came through and turned it out. Dang, we have 15 shares, 116 views. Uh, that one about to get boosted too. All right, let's see. That's the one I wanted to see. All right, cool. All right, let's see. All right, all right, so uh, family, I'm up, I'm out. Y'all have a great, 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 Great day. A day beyond greatness. A day that is amazing. A day that you change life. You do something incredible. Something amazing. All right. And of course, you know this is Brother Hot Tim. Right, and uh, I gotta change. This ain't the adventures of Brother Hot Tim, but hey, this is part of the adventure. All right, family, 
Uh, we will be popping up with our site soon at gnj.media. It's coming as well. So we got a lot of changes. So keep up. Keep up with the movement. All right, I'm out. Peace.